Hi, in this tutorial, I'll introduce you to Movie Plus and show you how to import your media files ready for editing. When you first open Movie Plus, you'll be greeted with the Startup Wizard. From here, you can start new projects, import or copy media, convert video files from one file type to another, and quickly open your most recent projects. You can also gain access to the online tutorials and support. For this tutorial, I'll start a new blank project. In the standard workspace, you can see the video preview pane on the left, the media, galleries and properties panes on the right, and the timeline at the bottom. Movie Plus initially opens in a standard definition format. If this doesn't match your video files, it doesn't matter as Movie Plus will help us to change the settings later. OK, let's start importing some media files. We use the Media pane to organise project files. The Media pane consists of three tabs, and the Project tab is used to organise the media files linked to the current project. We'll look at this now. If I click Import Media, you'll see that we have a few options. The one you choose depends on where your media is currently stored. If your media has already been copied to the computer's hard disk, all you need to do is click Import and browse to the files that you want. When you open the selected files, the thumbnails are displayed in the media pane, showing that they are now linked to the current project. If some of your files are stored on removable media, for example the SD card or DVD used in the camcorder, then you'll need to use the Copy from Device option. First, select the device card from the list, then click Next. Here, you can choose where you want the files to be copied to. As you can see, my files are already selected, but I want to add them to the media pane, so I need to select the option. I now just need to click Finish. The video files are copied to my Documents folder in Windows and are also automatically imported into the Movie Plus media pane. If you have a DV or mini DV camcorder, you'll need to use Capture to create media files that you can work on from your PC. See the Movie Plus help if you get stuck and you need some information. We'll finish this tutorial by adding a clip to the timeline. Drag a thumbnail from the media pane and onto the timeline. If your project settings don't match the clip settings, as in this example, you'll be asked if you want to update the project settings to match. Just click Yes. The clip is displayed on the timeline and in the video preview pane. That's all for this tutorial. You'll find more information in the How To pane, Movie Plus Help, and our other online tutorials. Thanks for watching.